Hey everybody. Um, we do a live, live, live cast Monday through, every day of the week actually. Now uh, we have shows though on uh, Tuesdays at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Sundays at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and I have been using the Audio Technica uh, 2020 USB mic, Plantronics 995 USB wireless microphones combination of Wirecast, uh, Audio Hijack Pro, all running on an iMac, and I felt it was time to upgrade our audio equipment, and you are looking at the chief components of this, a brand new condenser microphone, the MXL 990, it's an XLR mic, it's not a top of the line microphone, but it should be more than adequate for podcasting and doing our live webcast. It comes with a shock mount. Um, it's got some decent specs on it. Hard to beat the price. I paid $69 for it and it included a free 20 foot XLR cable. Probably not the best on the market, but as long as it works, that's what's important to me. Um, decent microphone. As I said, probably not the best in the world. I get that. But it should do the job. We are replacing the Plantronics 995 USB wireless headset with these. They're the Sony MDR7506 studio grade uh, headphones for monitoring, being able to hear my callers on Skype, uh, also use them to listen to music, what have you, through these headphones. That'll be patched into this. The Behringer Xenix 1204 USB Mixer. Now, just a little background on this. I spoke to Behringer. I've talked to Sweetwater Music. I talked to Musicians Friends, just to name a few. I've read about everything I could about mixers, particularly uh, there's a couple ways you can interface a mixer with a computer. Um, there's USB, there's FireWire, you can do it using eighth inch or three and a half millimeter to, our, uh, to quarter inch jacks. There are several different ways to interface a mixer with a computer, but after talking to the folks at Musicians Friends, I think this would be the right mixer for us. It's got some great features to it. It has uh, what's called Phantom Power. Uh, which is a form of a preamp, as I understand it, for the XLR microphones. Um, so there's four of those uh, uh, mic preamps built into it. It's got built-in compressors as well. Uh, there is a built-in USB audio interface that allows you to connect it directly to the computer rather than having to buy a separate piece of equipment to do a, a digital to analog conversion. Um, it also has what they call British equalization, which is supposed to give it a warmer tone. Uh, mute buttons for the channels, so if you want to cough or clear your throat, you can do that. Ultimately, a USB uh, a mixer gives you a whole lot more flexibility in your choice of microphones, of different audio sources, and being able to route that audio as you see fit. That's kind of the idea, as well as being able to enhance voices, pre uh, prevent clipping, ensuring audio levels stay reasonable, just a whole lot of things. So without further ado, and by the way, I bought this at Musician's Friend for $129, free shipping. Actually, I got it for 10% off of that. They had a uh, special promotion that day that I bought. So without further ado, I'm gonna go ahead and unbox it. It's a little on the heavy side, it's not light, but here we go. We're going to get this unboxed, and there's a couple tabs on the back. Top lifts off very nicely. And we're going to go ahead and see how it's packaged in here, like so. And we are, these are mounting racks to go in a rack. The power cord, one USB cable, got some uh, corner protectors into the box, 
looks like the owner's manual there's a software disc in there because there's a podcasting software music creation software comes with the mixer and here she is the mixer itself take off the corner block and we can go ahead and set this down Move set the box down uh, there we go and it's got uh, all wrapped in plastic tear the plastic off of it being careful with it and there it is right there that is the mixer uh, maybe what we can do is take the camera and we're going to go ahead and zoom in on it see if we can get the zoom to work there we go right there and here is the back side of the mixer again we'll zoom in you can see that once again the front Uh, has a comp a total of eight channels there are two looks like two stereo auxiliary returns oh let me zoom the mic out there we go two uh, stereo auxiliary returns four microphones can go in here's all your various channels it has a uh, it's plastic face on here, but it does have some metal. It's a combination of metal and plastic. I'd say it weighs about seven pounds. $129 at Musicians Friend. You can find it at other places where I can get it on Amazon.com and so forth. Uh, it does have building compressors on channels one, two, three, and four. Spot for your headphones. Uh, it has tape in and tape outs, auxiliary sends, pretty much everything you need to connect various audio devices and manipulate them all with a new Behringer Xenix 1204 USB mixer. Um, I think it's going to really help improve our audio and some of the things that we can do here at the studio. Check it out. Uh, recommend Musicians Friends for your audio gear. They were very easy to work with. Uh, very, very helpful folks. Make sure that you check out our live stream at the shows with a Z, T H E S H O W Z dot TV forward slash Frugal Tech. That's where you can catch our live stream where we're live streaming every day beginning at 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time and generally it runs till about 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time so check us out and of course we do a live show every Tuesday at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every Sunday at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time also visit us at frugalbrothers.com I'm Bruce Naylor your frugal tech make sure if it's in your shop not making you money or saving you money get it out of there we'll talk to you later